Number one, sledding. Angel pulls the sled with a force of 84 newtons at an angle of 32 degrees with the horizontal. Find the magnitude of the horizontal component of the force. How do we begin? Drawing it. Drawing it. Okay, so we have a sled. What does it mean when it says uh, pull 84 newtons at an angle of 32 degrees of horizontal? How do we begin drawing that? Oh, right. Okay, so flat, that means they're pulling it this way. Um, so what is, but it's at an angle. Oh, 32. So, uh, Jonathan there said flat. The reason, why did he start flat, not say vertical at the uh, y axis? Because this word here says. Horizontal. So we started horizontal and move up 30 degrees. This arrow is 84 degrees. Now it asks us to find the magnitude of the horizontal component. It's asking us to find them. It says the horizontal. First, what does component mean? Component form would mean x and y. Component means x and y. If it's saying horizontal component, then we're specifically looking for x. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to tie into the map that we've had forever, but just not seen it this way, is that we have this vector here. If I just draw a triangle, I'm looking for x. What does 84 represent here? The h, the y, the h. So, yeah, very good, Reagan. Okay, I figured it out now. Yeah, so if cosine is x over h, we plug in the information. Okay, well, we got it now, never mind. Got it now, never yeah. mind. I'm recording this. Go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll finish the video. You should probably start up with I just said something embarrassing on YouTube forever. No. I love you, <laughs> Okay, we'll find that out. What do we get? 1.56? 2.36. 2.36. So, say anything about rounding here? No. Now, we'll go to the nearest hundred. So as nearest hundred, it would be two four. Thirty one point two four, and this is would be in newtons. Was uh would be the new from the unit. Sorry.